Epica is here. Okay, welcome if you're new, welcome back if you are not. Forgive that outburst. I just, I was excited. So, um, we're here with, I don't know if I have made any more videos. Or if this is the only video I see at, as of the time of recording. This is Rosario featuring CL and Zico. Epic High. Apparently, there are a lot of, um, there are some Easter eggs that I will not know because I'm not a long time Epic High fan. So, some of the Easter eggs are from like much older videos before I even got into K, probably before I got into K pop. Definitely before, long before I got into K hip hop, which was a different, it has a different timeline in my life. I mean, I've seen some of them online, so I can know of them, but I don't, I don't think I'll spot any of them if there's any more. I don't think I'll spot them like that. So, um, without further ado, let's just get into the video, Rosario. Oh, I'm not you play. No, man, this need two earphones. This need two. These are two cuts. Yeah, yeah, it's the jare, I'm Okay, 
when I watch this again because whenever I catch all the lyrics coming out, I watch the video. So. Okay, so I watched the video again this time listening to the listening reading the lyrics um because they were there. Um this gives me no thanks vibes uh in a sense that it's like no thanks is it's like I don't I don't care for your your negative comments, I don't care for you know what you feel like I am and all you know, then look at something there. Um and this is kind of giving me those vibes where that and oh gosh what's the name of that song i don't remember the name of the song but i noticed i noticed the um the nod the easter egg for that song in the video i don't know why i can't remember the name of the song it also gives me um vibes from that song from what i can remember it's been a while since i've listened to it um and it made me realize that epic high i think one they're in that point in their career where they can make a lot of these songs but also two Epic High tends to make a lot of, um, a lot of, oh, I don't know how to put it, not, I, I have to make my own destiny kind of songs, it's like, I'm good, fuck the haters, when you can kick rocks, um, you don't determine, you don't determine, other than, you know, and then again, you don't know how the album them, or when I buy the album them, you like you hate buying the album them like is that is that that term yeah we buying the albums to trash it so you know thanks for the money anyway and it's just like but other than that like your comments can your comments can deter me like i appreciate those types of songs because they are important not just for the celebrities of the world but for your everyday man like we need to remember and I, it's unfortunate because it's just like people keep thinking, oh, well, you know, I'm nothing. So it doesn't really apply to me, but it does. Like the everyday man still needs to know that what people think about you is not as important as what you think about you. Um, and what you think people are saying about you, they're not saying nothing. Sometimes I'm really into the not saying nothing. And it's just like you, it's just you putting words in people's mouth and people, in people's head. So don't worry about it. And yeah, that's the that's basically the message from of this song too. You know, and I CL sounds so good. Like I think about it now and it's like there's nobody else that could have done yes, it's just the chorus, but like there's nobody else that could have done that chorus except CL. There's something so bad girlish about her <laughs> about her voice. Um something so I'm done with you focus about her voice that is portrayed very she she gets that feeling very well just from her voice um also that dress girl is that dress it look like a dress that dress girl okay get get you get you some um i love the imagery again there is some stuff that i will not uh get in terms of like the the easter eggs and whatever but the imagery was still really good regardless um the roses all over the place especially with the beginning i can't hear it but the lyrics were there and it was talking about it, the lyrics had said something about you know don't give me roses because i'll get for it so i don't remember exactly what he was saying um because i was paying attention to the rest of the song after that but the roses obviously mean something i don't i'm not sure what it means again that could be from another song i don't know, I don't know. but it was still visually very nice visually pleasing um and there's no Without being like clustered and just feel like you're looking at a bunch of things, for me at least, a bunch of things at once, um, there was, you, you didn't get bored either, you know, so that was nice. Anyways, that is it for this video. Um, you know what? After you click that red and that blue button, because YouTube says it will help me, how about on that black line, you let me know what videos I should watch. <clears throat> to get some of the easter eggs from this one i should do my own research but like i have too many things to do um and i'm trying to stay on top of a lot of stuff 
as of recording this like i'm not even supposed to be recording right now but i couldn't do it at any other time so let me know and i'll do like a whole maybe i'll do like a whole thing on on whatever this is um maybe i don't know so if you if you if you tell me what if you tell me what videos to look for to look to look into on um in the on the black line then maybe i'll do it i feel like i want to do something like that so like hey help me out uh anyways that is it for this video like i said yes thank you for watching like i didn't say and i will see you in another one like i always say